Hello everybody, uh, we're gonna play some Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines and <clears throat> we just killed that Asian vampire which means that um, we can go to Nox, you know, remember that ghoul and um, we're gonna uh, talk to him because that was actually uh, the quest he gave us so if I remember correctly he was standing oh I should put away my sword maybe Got a crossbow now, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, I think he was standing in front of the asylum. Got to st uh, start my little uh, timer watch here. I need to get some blood maybe first. That would be a good idea. Heal up. Okay, we can. Act I think we can actually take that uh, cab downtown later. But we're not going to do that now because we still have some unfinished business here. So we have the bums here. We could suck dry. I'm gonna start with him because he's police. Okay, he's gonna drive fast. That was not enough. We need more. Such a handsome bastard. Hello. So, now we got all our health back, because I don't know if you can actually see, but... Uh, if we drink blood, our health replenishes first, and after that, our blood pool uh, goes up. So, I think we sucked everything here we could, without being noticed. So, let's try, see if we can find another victim here. Uh, am I going back to where I just came from? I don't know. Mm, yes, I did. Great. Oh, look at that. Hello, old lady. Hello, Mr. Police Officer. There you go. Hello. No! What the hell? Masquerade? Oh, no. You gotta get the victims. Thank you for running straight into my arms. So I did a masquerade violation, which basically means I lost one point masquerade. I think I did. Let's get, it, get away from here. So I heard that um, when you lose all your masquerade, let's check that out. Yeah, if you lose all of them, you lose the game. I don't really know if you can actually um, replenish those. I think you can. Okay, there's the asylum. But I'm not sure about that. At least we got all our blood back. Or filled up. Oh. Hmm. Hello everybody, we're back with Vampire the Masquerade, and I'm sorry that the videos are coming a little slowly now, because uh, my girlfriend had to go to the hospital because of her appendix, and she's still not feeling very well, so I have to take care of her a little bit, so yeah, please excuse me for that. So we were going to find Nox, and finish that quest, and he should be in front of the asylum. I think he's in front of the asylum and I'm probably walking the wrong way again. Yes, because here's the blood bank. The asylum is right there. God! My orientation is the worst. What the hell are you doing? Nox? Well, we, s we met Nox somewhere else, I think. Okay. Or did Knox go somewhere else? I don't know. Let's look inside. Let's see if he's here. If not, we'll just do something else. <coughs> oh, there he is. Hey! So, like, how are you doing on that thing we talked about? He's dead. Oh, thank God! Oh, man! Yes! That thing was hounding me, like, every night. Look. Still haven't heard anything from Bertram. Sorry, okay? Uh, still let him know, but now, I have no way to repay you. 
Uh, any idea what that thing was? Must be some shit going on. Sounds serious. As a matter of fact, I can. Go see my man Trip at the pawn shop. He won't sell me just anymore to tell him he knows not, so he'll set you right up. Yeah, I think we tried this before, uh, but maybe there are going to be some new weapons that unlocked if we tell them that we know Nox. Who knows? Let's try that. Let's try that, and then we're going to go to apartment and see if there's any new news going on, because I just love the news program. And afterwards, we're going to take a cab, and we're going to go somewhere else and see... Uh, what awaits us there? So let's go to Trip's Pawn Shop. I wonder if there's like a head vampire, like one of the oldest, oldest uh, vampires around, stuff like that. Thanks for coming back. What you need? A nice store you've got here. Thanks. You, uh, new to Santa Monica? Yes, I am. What is there to do around here? Beats me. Santa Monica is dead. I don't know why anyone comes out here anymore. Are you afraid of the serial killer? Oh, let's ask, ask him about that. Yeah, it's freaking me out, to be honest. I've opened all night in Santa Monica. Please don't rank amongst the nation's most worthy. Okay. Heard anything new about it? The other night down the pier, bro. This dude got ripped apart. Same as the dude in Long Beach. Apart. You don't know how the killer's doing that either. Oh, yeah? I'll tell you, crazy stuff happens all the time, and it's like we just get used to it, you know, just going our way, do -do -do, but this, I don't know, these killings are chilling. A nice rhyme. Indeed, you should be careful. So, did you need anything in particular, or? Uh, I'd like to check out some weapons. All right. Come take a look then. What is that? Oh, crossbow bolts. Uh, we should stock up on guns. Uh, Brian and, and the comments told me I can sell crap. So I should do that. It's not much, but... Um, the purse is not worth anything. Don't take if mail. Maybe we'll need that. Let's sell the watch. Okay, I'm not gonna sell that. So, uh, should we buy some crossbow bolts? Yes. Mm -hmm, we should have quite a lot of money. Let's buy some crossbow bolts. Nice. Buy some shotgun ammo. Okay. How much? Do we have now 45 bullets, 114, 30 crossbow bolts. I'm fine with that. So let's talk to him once more because I Thanks think there was an back. option. What you need? Okay, I there's not. What we got today. All right. All right. So we <laughs> there's nothing new about the serial killer. I don't know if we actually have to walk around and. Um, ask random people about it. Hello, lady. Okay, we don't need any blood, so I'm not gonna uh, do anything with her. How many points do we have? Seven. Uh, should we raise our social skills a bit more? Maybe we should. Uh, think and remember. Research and intimidate feeds, perception, ranged combat. <coughs> Maybe we should take that for the range combat, but I don't know. Firearms? Let's raise firearms. Because we sure love our firearms, don't we? Okay, the police is gone here, which is pretty good. Uh, can we talk to the police officer? Probably not. He's warming himself on a bum fire. Alright. Um, yeah. So, I don't know. It seems like there's nothing much to do here. Mm, 
Mud Hunt. Yeah, that's in a different city. Carnival of Death. No hints there. So, <coughs> let us maybe go to a different place. Why not? could go back to the diner, but I don't want to... Can we actually talk to the crazy dude? Maybe he knows something about the killing. We can't. Hey, dude. The end is... Here? Near? Hmm, so maybe he saw the, the vampire. Uh, not the vampire, but the killer. Who knows? Get away. Smoke shop. Can I actually go in here? No. So let's talk to the cab driver. Where to? <sighs> Away from here. Just drive. Oh, look at that. Santa Monica. So let's go downtown. See what's up. Oh, what the hell? Are you waiting for me? Okay. Nothing I could have done there. Let's drain it. What? Let's take it and leave it out for the sunrise. We're going to have a lot of fun with this one. Think you could blow up our warehouse and get away with it? Ah, lick. <laughs> I want it, teeth. Camarilla, fuck. Boys, I think we could all use a little entertainment. Those of you sitting in the first few rows will get wet. The fuck? Son of a bitch! Oh, leave. Nine, nine, Rodriguez. Yeah. <laughs> Three of us. What are you gonna do? Shoot us? This ain't over. We'll find you. You too, Rodriguez. You're both dead. Nobody messes with a sabat and lives. Keep moving. Trouble sure seems to like you. Good effort. <laughs> Execution needs a little work. You look like shit. Name's Nines. Thanks for the help. Should have been more careful, Luby. This ain't the Burbs. The Burbs. I could have taken them. Want me to go get them? Uh... Yeah, bring him on, should we? No. Oh, that's okay. That's what I thought. Kid, I got things to deal with. Why don't you pay me a visit at the last round tonight? I don't know what you've heard so far, but it's time you heard the real story. Oh, that this sounds... This is a mean existence. Stay out of trouble, kid. Oh, that sounds interesting. He's gonna tell us the real story. Can't wait to hear that, to be honest. All right, we are in downtown LA. All right, where do we go? <laughs> That's probably gonna be a pretty big place. Hey, whore. So, let's look at our quests. Uh, the Regent's Riddle. Okay, we have to look for a mystical sun. sun. Come find me where burns the mystical sun. The Skyline Apartments. And the Venture Tower. So those are three things we have to look for. Venture Tower, Skyline Apartments. What the hell are these people? Hmm. 
I wonder if there's a map. Maybe there's a map at the bus stop. Baby sale? What the hell is going on? They're reckoning. Okay, there's no map at the bus stop. Oh yeah, there is. Alright, where are we? You are here. Uh, Skyline Apartments are not far away, so let's go there. Oops, wrong button. Um, those are probably the Skyline Apartments. Probably, probably. Let's go inside. And just look for that bounty hunted bonds, dude. I need to go to 2A. Hey there, Chief. Small world, huh? <laughs> yep, after that gallery, I, I didn't think I'd be able to get a job guarding a room full of jack squat from the boogity man. <laughs> but then I get a call offering me this sweet night shift slot, and I'm back in a security game. Ah, well, uh, enough about my lucky break. You, uh, here to see one of the big wigs, Chief? Okay, I'm in the Venture. Oh, that's probably the Ven Venture, Venture, the Venture Tower. Uh, or Venture? I don't, I don't, I remember. Yeah, I'm here to see Lacroix. Would that be Sebastian Lacroix of the Lacroix Foundation, or Dwayne Lacroix of Insurrection Baby Formula Company? Oh, that is actually really weird. <laughs> uh, Barani, no knows what I mean probably when he sees this because those two names are kind of familiar weird <sighs> yeah Sebastian Lacroix uh, okay then Mr. Lacroix he told me to expect someone fitting your description sometime tonight you go right on up thank you yeah uh, you have a good power meeting or uh, whatever it is you type to up there do you need any security well you just ring the front desk and ask for officer Chunk that's me, in case you're wondering. Officer Chunk, yeah, thanks, Chunk. I remember that. Bye. All right, elevator. Where are the elevators? Uh, weird. How is that thing floating? Oh, okay, it's on a pole. <laughs> Ah, damn it. Okay, where is the elevator? You probably told me and I just didn't read it. Dude, where the hell is the elevator? <laughs> oh, there it is. God damn it. Uh, PH? What's PH stand for? Oh, look at that big motherfucker. Nice room you've got here. There you are. I was informed of your presence in the building. Since you're here, I'll take the liberty of assuming you've destroyed the warehouse. This is correct, yes? Yes, yes, yes. Of course, uh, yes, that is... Most excellent. I had no doubt you'd prove my decision a prudent one. I trust you encountered no impediments to your progress on account of my personnel. Uh, no, none at all. Yeah, let's try not to be... make enemies. That is the answer I like to hear. You've done well, circumstances being what they were. I will admit, not many in your position would have overcome such a trial. But don't misunderstand me. It was no fool's errand. You may yet prove to be a genuine asset. It's a bit disturbing a lack of talent within this organization as of late. Tell me, what would you say to doing a bit of reconnaissance for me? Uh, I would say, what, what's in it for me? Don't be so hasty to inflate your own worth. You've succeeded once, very admirable. But in the grand scheme of it all, an infant stride of progress. If you're looking to make a name for yourself, listen very carefully. There have been whispers, rumors spreading around the Kindred community concerning the Elizabeth Dane, the cargo ship that was towed into port recently. Have you heard of it? No. The Dane was found out at sea. The reports say it was without crew, but they had yet to report a fate of said crew. 
The police are investigating the Dane as we speak. Even the Nosferatu have little information on what's been found. However, the reason the ship has caused such speculation is because it was transporting an object called the Ankaran Sarcophagus. Now, I'm not one to predicate a decision based on conjecture, so what I need is fact. And more importantly, I need evidence that the occurrences on the Dane were not supernatural in nature, and in no way relate to this Ankaran Sarcophagus. All right. What do you need me to do? You have three objectives. One. I want you to examine the sarcophagus for anything unusual. You may sense something peculiar about the sarcophagus. In fact, many kindred in the city have reported an uneasiness in the air since the Dane's arrival. Do not, under any circumstances, open the Ankaran sarcophagus. Secondly, the police have begun their investigation. Find out what they have concluded thus far. Thirdly, take the cargo manifest for the ship. I want to find out what else it was carrying. The last thing we want is police aware of our existence, so be careful what you do in front of them. And unlike the warehouse, you cannot wholesale slaughter a ship full of lawmen without consequences. Is this understood? Yep. Good. Oh, and it has come to my attention that you had an encounter with Nines Rodriguez earlier. The man so does love to throw that cretinous charm of his brashly about. What exactly did Mr. Rodriguez say? Mm -hmm. He asked me to visit him at the last round. I see. Then, you should go humor the by the numbers rhetoric he's so desperately aching to spew. Oh, please, before the chance of fascist oppressor from that dive of theirs clog the air and choke the local kind. <coughs> Fine. Give the Anarch community my regards. Okay. Look at that guy. Big. Oh, he's aware. Alright. So we finished that. Uh, so now let's look for the Skyline Apartments. Okay, so we should use blades for vampires have to. I don't know. That is something I would like to know. Okay. So we were at the tower. Number six. Yeah, so we did walk the wrong way, I guess. end this part here. I'll see you guys in the next part when we uh, do that bounty hunter job. Goodbye.